Ah, uh, hello, Len. Don't call me Len, I'm a bishop. <laughs> yes, Dougal, uh, your grace is more appropriate. Oh, your grace, right, hello. Anyway, uh, yet again, I am dragged away from my warm fireside to come and deal with the cast of Police Academy. <laughs> <laughs> you behave yourself now, Jack. Are you listening to me, Jack? No! <laughs> oh, oh, would you like a drink, your grace? I have a small one, please, thank you. <laughs> Just, uh, would you like ice with it? Uh, a drop of soda. <laughs> I'll just get the glasses. Hey, come on! <laughs> <laughs> Come to your grace. Time for Jimmy Poo's. <laughs> oh, thanks very much, Mrs. Doyle. That'll be grand. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Oh, there you are, Bishop Brennan. I thought I should tell you your car is parked outside. Yes, I know it is. I parked it there myself. <laughs> The tyres look a bit flat. I could give them a bit of a blow-up for you at the pump. No. What kind of air do you normally put in them? We have ordinary... Or, well, that's all we have, actually. <laughs> and if you're looking for the wipers, I have them in the kitchen. What? <laughs> they look like they needed a little wash. <laughs> the only trouble is <laughs> I broke the side window while I was snapping them off. <laughs> Leave my car alone and don't touch it again. Just one question, Your Grace. Is your car diesel or petrol? Leave it alone, Mrs. Doyle. Oh, no, 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 no. This is just curiosity, Your Grace. Diesel if or... If diesel is diesel! Right. So it's not petrol. No, it's not petrol. Right. So it would do a terrible amount of damage if I put petrol in. Yes, it would. It would completely ruin the car's engine. Well... <laughs> I certainly won't be doing that, then. <laughs> I suppose you must clock up a fair old mileage every year going round the diocese, you know. <laughs> doing the old uh, bishop sort of really, really. Where and... is my room? Well, um, yours is the spare room, Your Grace. It's the first on the right. Uh -huh. uh, this lettuce. <laughs> oh, no, thanks. I've already had some. You, you take it. <laughs> no, really, no, really, like really, I mean, this lettuce, where did it come from? You don't have rabbits, do you? No, of course no! Because, you see, I don't like them at all. I had an experience once with someone. It wasn't very nice. They got into a lift with me and they started to nibble at my cape and, and everything. It was... Well, you've absolutely nothing to worry about, Your Grace. <laughs> no, that's just where we, um... where we grow the lettuce. <laughs> you, you grow lettuce indoors in a cage. Yes, it's safer, you know. Um, no one can steal it and, uh... Well, you know... It, it brightens up the room. Uh-huh. Hmm. Um, Quilly, what is this? <laughs> That's, um... Caviar. <laughs> caviar. <laughs> yes, well, it's not every day we have a bishop around, so we thought we'd get the caviar out. <laughs> Right, so what you have done is you have spread some caviar down there so I can get down on my hands and knees and eat off the floor. Yes. What do you think I am, Crilly, a pony? <laughs> I'm going to my bed. Where did you put them, Dougal? The bunnies? <laughs> <laughs> Somewhere really safe, Ted. <laughs> where, where would that be? Guess. It's almost like the type of place you wouldn't even think of. <laughs> God, uh, I don't know. Oh, that small room behind the kitchen. The coal cellar. I've got it. The shed. No, it's not the shed. Come on, Ted, think about it. Where's the last place you'd think I'd put them? <laughs> I suppose the last place I'd think you'd, you'd put them would be... Um, would actually be... Bishop Brennan's room. Bingo! <laughs> think about it, Ted. I put the bunnies in the last place he'd ever expect to find them, in his own room. He'd never look there. <laughs> Your face! Your face! 